Sonnet eight of In Excelsis by Lord Alfred Douglas. This LibriVox recording is in the public domain. But so to use oneself as to entice the visit of such love, so dignified with such a sovereignty, may scarce betide us the sad outcast heirs of paradise. Hardly the merchant paid the exceeding price of that one pearl whose lustrous sheen outvied the zenith of his longing, else denied to any less than utter sacrifice. And how shall we, unemptied of desire of all created things, command our love or open hopeful casements to the dove? Nay, but the spark prevents consuming fire, the seedling predicates the harvest's hoard, from depth to height, love corresponds to love. End of section.